<laughs> All right. So we're going to grab this chest. We're going to go ahead and give it a new material. We're going to give it a geometry and a bevel. And then we're going to give it some vector math with a color ramp. You can mess around with this however you want. Attach it. That That's all that this takes, really. Right now, I'm setting up some environment lighting so you can actually see things. Here is where I start messing with it. And you can see there's the edge highlight right there. Now, you just copy the materials. You assign them to what you want them to be. And then you change the colors in the color ramp to be what you want. Look at that. Edge highlights. Stylized. Looks great. Even better, you can take this and you can you can just bake it as a texture. Right here, I did not have the UVs done on the chest, so I just kind of <laughs> smart projected them, which is horrible. Don't ever do that. And then I went to the leaf. This one already has UVs. Boom. Dropped colors in, changed them, dropped the materials, made them their own. Same thing to the tree. And then for the heck of it, I just did it on the mannequin, which I just had in there for scale. And it looked ugly. What I was trying to do was get it to look, you know, like the regular mannequin, except dirty. And that didn't work, so I changed it. But yeah, it's easy as that. Then you go ahead and you throw the, the leaf or the chest to the Photoshop. You're done. <laughs>